Good morning, folks. It's a very sad day today uh, because of the war, of course. And uh, uh, I've been through some of the wars between 2000 and 2010, South America and Africa. And I know uh, nobody wins. There are always only losers in a war. So I hope this will this war will be over soon. And I'm not going into political stuff that I really don't know much much about. But um, I hope there will be as less pain as possible. That's my only hope. And uh, okay, actually the reason why I was doing this YouTube video was because of um, some rumor about Sonic Gear in 2022. And it may be a good distraction for some of the people out there to think about something else. Um, the past year uh, we had a couple of sunny announcements and uh, we were pretty much very often spot on and I'm working with the same sources to gather information about their plans um, regarding this year. And the first thing I want to be clear is that uh, the very same sources keep updating me all the time about continuous changes in the roadmap. So Sony is gouging what's the situation with the, with the sensors. And it's um, the tendency is to postpone all camera announcements. And so for example, the ZV style camera that I was rumored and planned to be announced in spring could be delayed to autumn because of the cost of the sensors that would be very high at this moment. And uh, so it also appears that the R7R5 could be postponed by a couple of months. And the i9 III that was supposed to be the last camera to be announced this year may be announced in 2023, early 2023 only. But please keep in mind that Sony has the cameras actually nearly ready so we, they still want to see how the situation will change the next months and so um maybe they will uh reshape the roadmap again and uh, anticipate the postponed <laughs> announcements <laughs> so that's the thing with the cameras the one thing that i the message i got clearly from my sources is that um, it appears that lens announcement were, are going to be anticipated. So like in spring we can expect a couple of more lenses than previously planned. I hope there will be the 85.12. I hope there will be the 2470 GM, the new version. But I also heard about some new lenses and I also got some specs that I want to verify because those lenses are quite unexpected for me. Uh, I will write about those lenses the next weeks. Um, so at earliest we can expect an announcement around mid-March, -Mar if everything goes well, um, and with other lenses coming in May and June. That's more or less the situation. Uh, but it will be not year uh, with uh, with announcement dates. It will keep going forward and backwards. Um, the one thing I'm also working is um, on is uh, rumors about a completely new kind of camera. Uh, don't get too hyped about this because uh, the last time I got a rumor about this, it was a, a A7C. I mean, it's a nice camera, but it wasn't like changing the world uh, so I still have to figure out what I mean with new kind of camera it could be that it's a pre-announcement of something that's coming in 2023 um, of course the rumors are going wild that it's a medium format camera or that's another kind of full frame camera or, there, or some sort of magic APS-C camera so but don't hold on on those rumors until uh, we get something solid so that's the current situation. Um, so I hope we will get uh, finally some announcement this in March, and uh, I will keep you updated if I get some um, new info about new cameras and lenses. Bye.